Hi everyone, welcome to FAF YouTube. This week on YouTube, we are going to be building a Porsche here at FAF Porsche in Vaughan. And I'm here with Elliot Mar Martins. And Elliot, this is such a great opportunity for us to do a deep dive and tell everybody how you can really customize your perfect Porsche with so many options available to people who want to buy a Porsche. Yeah. Tell us about the program and really why they should look at customizing and making it something that they truly uh, love. Yeah, for us, we kind of, Porsche's always prided themselves on being able to create a unique uh, vehicle to the individual, almost like a fingerprint for everyone's car. So today we're gonna to be doing a 2022 Cayenne GTS, which is a very popular SUV for us at the moment. And we're just gonna go through a little bit of a deep dive on some uh, very popular options, some unique stuff that you might not have thought of to do on the car. And kind of give it that one step from the normal car you see at the shopping mall, I have to say. <laughs> yes, exactly. It's like making it your own, right? Yeah. And you have the opportunity to even take it further yeah. with some other options that we yeah, will we explore as well. Yeah, we have a Porsche exclusive manufacturer, uh, which we are a Porsche exclusive manufacturer dealership mm -hmm. here at FAF Porsche. Uh, so those are a little bit more of a personalization um, options that we have available to it. And if you want to take it even one step further than that, on the Cayenne variation, we do offer paint to sample, which is a new uh, addition to the car for the first time in a long time. Uh, so that is even more unique. Uh, mm -hmm. You can pick a color to your specific preference, which we think is even that one step on top of making it that close to like your fingerprint on yeah. your vehicle. You're getting that bespoke experience yeah. with Porsche. And right now we are here at FAF Porsche and Vaughn. Like I said, this is, the fitting lounge yes. and it gives yeah. people an example of some of the things that you can choose for your vehicle yeah. as well as a sort of digital configurator which yes. gives them the opportunity to really see what it might look like right yeah for everyone's and when they're at home building their cars obviously they're all basing it off the computer screen that you see here but when you come to the dealership and you're in our fitting lounge it's nice to feel and touch and see what the colors actually look like in the natural light yes because right? on a screen it's hard to really recognize what you're picking so yeah, we have some of our examples here, which we'll kind of go through off our computer screen here. We are the color we're gonna work with today, quartzite gray, mm -hmm. with our chalk interior, some carbon trim, and then we have our leather uh, carpet mats with the embroidery on the outside and on the inside, and then we have some this contrast stitching that we have over here. So in this specific demonstration, we have chosen a Cayenne GTS, yes. which a lot of people are choosing anyway. Yeah. Um, but when they sit down for their appointment, how long does it take and what's the starting point in this process? Yeah, so starting point is a customer reaching out to us, yeah. acknowledging that they have some interest in the vehicle. One of our sales associates would reach out to them, schedule a time for them to come into the dealership and kind of go through the process on the builder like we're gonna go through now. It's a pretty tedious one. Their Porsche is uh, well known for having a lot of personal options that can make the car just as unique as the individual that wants the car. So it usually takes about an hour, two hours, depending on how deep dive you wanna go into it. And then from that point on, if the customer is good with that process, then we finalize an order, take a deposit, and then your timeline, depending on your allocation month, can vary from four months, six months. Some people do wait a year for their cars mm -hmm. also because they're just that unique for them. Wow, yeah. so we have the Cayenne GTS here on the screen. Yeah. Have you already selected that color yeah. for our customer? Yeah, okay. so we selected a quartzite gray Cayenne. We do have multiple other colors that which we is have this there, color. which is the color right there, which I think looks really sharp. Love it. And we've kind of paired it up with uh, some wheel options that I think look really good on the car, which we did the 22 inch sport classic wheel in the exterior color. So pretty unique option that a lot of people kind of, I think it's hard to visualize on the builder. It's easier to see the car in person with that. Sure. And so what you're looking at, the wheels are actually painted in the same color as the exterior car. As the body? Yes. Wow, what a, what a nice yeah. option to nice have Nice little touch, yeah. yeah. And if we scroll down okay. into our leathers, so our interior colors, uh, you have your standard black here, and then you have your GTS package, mm -hmm. which is uh, stitching, which we have available shown on the uh, down here. And, but this time around, we did the chalk on graphite blue, which really kind of brightens it up on the inside, which mm -hmm. I'll go into here. So it does show you an interior shot. Yeah, it'll the, show you. Yeah, it'll give you a kind of the. Oh, I love that. A nice representation of what we're working with now, which I think is a nice contrast from seeing the usual black interior cars nowadays really brightens up the interior, gives a little bit more class to it. 
I love that you can see it and what it will look like, but then you also, as you said, touch is yeah. very important when yeah. you're selecting something like this. Correct, yeah. And then, yeah, when we go through the rest of our builder here, we have different seating options. So yeah. we always usually try to have some cars in the showroom too that have these seating configurations because you really have to feel it to see what it, it's like. This one here, we picked the 18-way seats. We're gonna go with the sport seats. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> We're in a sporty SUV. I love it. Yeah, so the 18-way seat, probably one of our most popular seats for a Cayenne GTS. What right. it's gonna give you, it gives you a, a bunch of different adjustability to the vehicle. So you have your thigh support, which can inflate and deflate to make it a little bit more hugging. As well on your rib section there, you can inflate and deflate the seat. Yeah. And then for taller occupants, you have your leg extension to make it a little bit more of a nicer GT car to have around. Okay, and it's I love also that it's broken down by price so you can see what yeah. you're getting into, exactly. you know, in terms of the options. Yeah, one option that we clicked on additionally, which doesn't show on our configuration here, but it will, will what we are going to do is to kind of change the interior to give it even more of a little bit of a personal touch. Mm -hmm. We have something called the uh, seat centers painted in a contrasting leather color. So what we're doing now is we're gonna do the seat, the middle section of the seat here yeah. will be slate gray. Just to add that little bit more touch to the inside. So if someone saw it, they walked by and they're like, oh, wow, this car looks different than some of the other cars we've seen. What, it's really a design choice, right? Exactly. It, yeah, I exactly. love that. Especially if you're doing a light interior, a seat center uh, option is actually very good for wear on the car. Because if you're sitting on the seat every day and you have a light colored interior, sometimes it is a little bit of a tougher car to always maintain. Sure. With a di darker seat center, it is a lot more easier to keep up. Okay. Yeah. And then when we scroll down through some of our main options, which is our premium package and premium plus. So I have to say majority uh, options, very popular with the premium plus package on a Cayenne GTS. So it's gonna give you a lot of familiar options that people are used to having. All right, and now we're going into the exterior portion of the car here, which we have uh, clicked off our sport design package in carbon fiber. A uh, nice accent for the quartzite gray exterior that we have with the vehicle, as well as the sport design mirrors in carbon fiber too, to kind of tie it all in together. I think it kind of encompasses a really nice, clean, sporty car that we're trying to go off. Which and this would, is what it looks like, right? Yeah, that's okay. what the finish uh, would be glossy carbon on the exterior of the car. So Elliot, we've built the exterior of the car. Now we have to move to the interior, yeah. which is where you spend most of your time. Correct, yeah. So a great chance to make it stand out. What options do we have so that we, we have to choose for this? Yeah, process? we started off the main one with our interior color of choice that we picked, which was slate gray on chalk interior. And then we encompassed the seat centers in slate gray, which we have the outside here. And then some additional items that we added onto the inside of this specific car is we did some interior carbon fiber trim work. We also did a carbon fiber steering wheel just to add a little bit more of that carbon fiber touch. And then one nice little uh, touch that we did was the floor mats that you see here. Mm -hmm. We did it with the leather surrounds and then you have the embossing in the inside there. Now also, this is what shows when you open the car door, yes, right? Correct. You have that yeah. special badging there. Yeah. And it's a big, uh, it's a small little uh, touch on the inside, but I think when you open the door, it's very inviting to see. Yeah. And it kind of sets off the whole interior the way you're looking at it right. as a whole. And then you have some additional items that you can do are your stitching colors contrasted. So the slate gray does come with a contrast stitch on the top dash, but if you want to go even more further, you can get the seats themselves that are chalk. You can invert the stitching also and get them in slate gray. It looks like such a small detail, but it really is a large one because yeah. if you've been inside the cabin of a Porsche, there's stitching, fine stitching everywhere, right? Yeah. So that's nice that they can pick an option. Do you find that people normally make some pretty bold design choices oh, yeah, or you, do they tend to play it safe with their you Porsche? Got, you, you always have a couple of customers here and there, <laughs> the ones that are, you know, keep it close to the chest and they'll yeah. do just like your standardized car. But then you do get the people that enjoy this process so much that they're putting so much of their own personal touch into the car. And I think that's, that really stands out once you see the car show up. Oh yes, well what a great experience, right? Yeah. It must evoke so much emotion when they spend so much time building, waiting for the car, oh, yeah. and then it actually arrives. Yeah, like yeah, we get some clients that spend hours and hours before they even call us to let us know they want a car. They sure. built the car maybe 15 times at home and then <laughs> they come here with their Porsche code, which is kind of how we start the process too. So they'll come in with, our port with a Porsche code, which we can enter into our online system and it'll show everything that they pre-built already. And then us as sales associates, we can kind of go through it and fine tune it to make it, maybe if they forgot to add one option or if we have a personal opinion on another one, kind of want to make the car right for them. 
uh, and that Porsche code then we can give back to the customer with the updated information. And I think that's one thing that always sets us apart with our cars is being able to take it home after and mm -hmm. look at what you did. Yeah. And then obviously once the car arrives, that's when you get to actually see all your hard work and labor of fighting over your computer screen, trying to figure <laughs> out exactly what you had to do. <laughs> well, I love that they can start it at home when they're, you know, there's no pressure environment, yeah. but they can just take, really take their time and then come here and, and working with a professional, you can point out things that maybe, as you said, they've missed or based yeah. on personal experience, you could say, you know what, this stitching looks really good or yeah. those I mean, insider it's, tips. It's always nice when some customers really take uh, everything that you've kind of, all the years of experience you've had in the car and they even want to see your view on the car. Sure. So some customers come into and they say, I want this car, but I want you to design it for me. I want you to pick all the options and pick the colors and that kind of process. It's a lot to, for someone to put that much like faith into you. Mm -hmm. and right off the bat to say, you can do it. I know you're going to do it the best. But okay, that's a good day when yeah. you get to do that. When I get to do it, that's always a fun day, I have to say, yeah, which I've been lucky enough. I have some really amazing customers that have given me that opportunity to yeah. build their dream car for them. And some of them don't even let me, I can't even tell them what colors I've picked. They're just waiting to see what it looks like when it shows up. Wow, unbelievable. So we've built our car here. Yeah. It, we, it breaks it down in terms of price and yeah. you could get you can a really good the, idea of what it looks like. Yeah, you can see option per option based pricing on all yeah. of it. We can do uh, seat belts in a different color, which was a nice interior touch that we did. And instead of removing removing the black seat belt, we decided to do the slate gray seat belt. So everything in the interior kind of all ties into each other. It's not an off color that's really going to stand out right out of the gate. Mm -hmm. It looks great. I think we did a good job. I think we did a pretty good job. Yeah. yeah. <laughs>